NBC News correspondent Vaughn Hilliard, who covers the Trump campaign, with the latest on each candidate's campaign. Vaughn, we'll start with you. So last night we had the Al Smith dinner here in New York City, which benefits Catholic charities. It's a tradition that goes back to the Kennedy-Nixon race so long ago. Um, usually both candidates go. Last night, VP Harris sent a video instead. Melania Trump was there making a rare appearance. What were the headlines for Mr. Trump? Last right, night? this is a different era in our politics, if I may. And Kamala Harris not appearing there last night was noteworthy because usually this is a venue where jokes are cracked between the two presidential candidates, excuse me. And eight years ago, it was Hillary Clinton and Donald Trump. And there were some uncomfortable moments between the two. And that is where you saw the Harris campaign take their efforts to battleground Wisconsin. They submitted a three and a half video, but it was Donald Trump over the course of nearly a half hour gave his own version of a roast. Take a listen to one of his jokes. There's a group called White Dudes for Harris. Have you seen this? White Dudes for Harris. Anybody know? Are some of you here? White Dudes for Harris. Doesn't sound like it. But I'm not worried about them at all because their wives and their wives' lovers are all voting for me. <laughs> Every one of those people is voting for me. This is, was really quite a crowd. You saw Chuck Schumer, the Democratic, uh, uh, the Democratic senator here from New York, sitting right next to him. Governor Kathy Hochul was there. Robert Kraft, the owner of the Patriots, they haven't spoken since January 6th. They were one-time friends. He was sitting in front of him. Michael Bloomberg, the former New York City mayor, who also tried to run for president in 2020, sitting there as well. There was one moment where he took a crack at the Harris family. There were other moments where he told the Catholics in the room, this was for Catholic charities, that the owner was on them to vote for him because Kamala Harris doesn't care about Catholics, suggesting her appearance there was her sending a statement. Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or follow us on social media.